Hey guys, what's up? Bro here with Planning Bro, and this is last week's spread. Before we get into it, don't forget to also follow my Instagram at Planning Bro and like this video and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. But this is what the spread looks like last week, and this is the week that we are planning for. And here is the very gorgeous kit that I will be using. This is from Planning Roses, and I really love the colors of this kit. And it's been a little chilly today and kind of this week in general in Florida, so I thought it was kind of appropriate to use it for this week. So let's get into it. So yeah, I decided this week to do something a little bit different with my plan with me and alternating the top and the bottom, but keeping the middle section, which is typically the today section, all the same. Uh, and you'll see kind of how it looks obviously in the end. I'm also filming once again using the mic stand that I adapted into a camera stand thing because it mounts to the side of my desk and it's a lot easier than using a tripod. Um, I just wasn't happy with the lining when it came to the tripod and I just think this looks a lot better. So there might be some moments where it's a little bit shaky because of that, but in the long run, I know it looks better on the setup. So first I put the to-do headers down, just every other, so I kind of knew where they went and kind of what colors I was using. And then putting down the checklist, I was also really bad about keeping this in frame because I'm not used to using the setup again. I will get there. I also decided to lift it up and use some whiteout. I ended up not using it throughout the entire spread because I forgot, honestly, um, so I need to go back I probably won't go back, but eventually I'll do it. I also added an apostrophe because I hated that that clip art didn't have it in there and it was annoying me a little bit, so I fixed it. <laughs> um, and then just putting, you know, doing all of Monday and then now doing Tuesday, but starting with the little things. And then adding the header and then I realized, oh, I should probably wipe that out as well. And I went ahead and whited out all of those. I really hope with the next Erin Condren release, which should be later this year, um, early summer, I guess, um, I'm hoping that they end up designing it with like the lighter borders because if they don't, I don't know if I'm going to get another Erin Condren. I might try using a Happy Planner again and just adapting the stickers to the Happy Planner because I just, I don't like how it looks when you put stickers over it. It's really hard to plan with and I just, I'm just not a fan of it. So I'm really hoping that they change it, but if they don't, we'll, uh, we'll figure it out. I might end up actually getting a Happy Planner for this year anyway, just to kind of play around with some weeks to see if I like it since I have a lot of extra kits and you know that type of thing and just see see how we feel so anyways now we're moving along i'm basically doing the same thing for every day except alternating the top and the bottom i also tried keeping the full boxes a little bit different each day because i wanted i didn't want like the same colors next to each other so if a color had predominantly pink i would try and add something you know like the next one would be more blue i guess and as I mentioned in the beginning, I absolutely love these colors in this kit. I think they are gorgeous. I just, I love it. They're very muted and pastel and just so pretty. So I was really happy when I was planning this because I just, I just loved the colors. Downside of the colors is the little dash marks do show through. But again, I'm hoping that eventually changes with, you know, the new Erin Condren planners coming out. So fingers crossed, I guess. Um, and now we're finishing up the weekend, adding the checkbox, which I do like these checkboxes. I really like the uh, like little like snow flurry things on it because that's the only snow I'm going to be seeing because, again, I live in Florida. <laughs> it does not snow here. Uh, and then just finishing up with that. Also with the spread, I tried to use as much of Planning Rose's stickers as I could because I did, as you saw in Wednesday's video last week, I ended up purchasing a bunch of functional items, so I was trying to pretty much use mostly her stuff because I, I like keeping it cohesive, but I did introduce some other shops as well, but not too many. And you can't see it here, but I'm using the final full box on the bottom to act as like the bottom washi, that's what I'm showing right there, and I'm grabbing my little like cutting tool thing, like a little exacto knife I guess, to, which is what that lid's from, <laughs> to make it match. The, the box itself. So I realized that I was in frame and that's what I'm doing right here. And then I'm using just a Panera gift card that I have that's old and to kind of like line it up. I didn't fully cut through it because I knew I could just rip it and it wasn't going to matter because I was putting a box over it anyway. So normally I would just do it in the actual sticker page, but for that I, did, I you know, 
didn't really care too much. So now I'm figuring out the little things, um, which is why I bust out my phone, because I'm figuring out what TV shows are what day. I've shown that app before. I absolutely love it. It's amazing. So I'm basically filling out all the TV shows and writing them down and then putting it in my planner so that I remember. I don't really watch too much TV, but there are a couple shows that come on, like This Is Us, The Rookie, and Manifest, as well as Supergirl that I've been keeping up with. Um, I'm usually like an episode or two behind, so I, although I do mark it in my planner, if I don't have time that week, I won't watch it. And then I usually watch catch up on shows on Saturday and Sunday when I work, so... And then obviously we have Plan With Me Monday, uh, so I put a YouTube sticker, which is from Planning Roses, as is the Instagram sticker. And last week on my main Instagram, like my personal one, I posted every day on my Instagram and it actually went really, really well. So I'm going to try and do that this week on my planner Instagram. I don't know exactly when I'm posting every day, except for Monday and Wednesday, obviously being like midweek and, you know, like my regular Plan With Me image um but we shall see my goal is to post every day and that is exactly what we're gonna do so if you're not already following it you saw at the beginning but planning vero if you want to follow me and see what i post I'm trying to trying to be more active in my socials so we'll see but yeah i just put like an instagram down for each one as well as the like little icon and then that filming sticker is from dizzy daisy dreams and then i'm going through my stack of planning roses stickers that i got out because we're gonna film and we're going to edit on Wednesday as well. And the laptop sticker is from the kit, as is the take out the garbage sticker. And then I forgot that I didn't put the weekend banner down, so I just put it on the bottom there because I figured that that, that works just fine. <laughs> and then I'm going to clean my brushes on Monday, which I was kind of excited that I got that sticker because I trying to clean my brushes at least once or twice a week. And then we're going to print and cut stickers on Wednesday. By the way, we're going to be filming a special video. Um, it won't be up this week, but it'll probably be up next week if I'm able to film it this week, where I'm going to show you guys how I print and cut stickers that I purchased online, so like printable kits and stuff, and kind of showing like my process for that, so be on the lookout for that. And then the reading sticker is also from her, as is the coffee sticker. I started reading um, Anne Rice, <laughs> the vampire books, um, finally, because I finished the book I was reading previously, which was Slayer, which is kind of like the same timeline as Buffy. Um, so I'm in a very vampire mood, so. So the Bill Deuce sticker was from Planning Rose as well as the decluttering. I ended up not decluttering my room last week like I want to do, but since I did so much deep cleaning last week, I wanted to at least clean out my closet and my dressers in my room, as well as just like donate as much stuff as possible. Um, you know, really do spring cleaning a little bit early since I had to clean so much for my party last week, which by the way, went really well. Uh, so the blog sticker is from Dizzy Daisy Dreams, and then we're obviously filming our plan with me on Sunday, and that is also a Dizzy Daisy Dreams sticker. And then we did an emoji for, uh, you know, editing some videos, and that sticker is from Coffee Monsters Co. So overall, I was really happy with how this looked. Um, here I am basically uh, decluttering everything and kind of making the desk look nice, and I'm tried putting the flags on the corner, but I ended up not liking how they looked. So what I ended up doing is just not doing that. And then just kind of showing you guys what stickers I still had left. But overall, really, really happy with how this looks. Um, I tried being fancy with <laughs> showing my planner to kind of give you guys a closer look. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I put out new videos every Monday for Playing With Me Monday and sometimes bonus videos on Wednesday. Overall, really happy with this. Love the colors. Can't wait to see how it turns out. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and thumb this video up. And I will catch you guys later. Thanks again for watching. Bye.